Texas Tech lines up to kick this one off, and we're just about set to get underway. He just drills this one. And they can forget about returning this one. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. And they make the stop around the 35-yard line. He gets another set of downs and, more importantly, opens up a whole host of play-calling possibilities for the coaching staff. Nice run there. taken down around the 48-yard line. He got the ball, and he was off like a shot. This guy has some big-time speed. Caught open field. And down he goes around the 47-yard line. That play fake good for five yards. for a loss. Those linebackers do a great job of stopping the run, but they need to be careful of the play-action pass. You can easily get fooled and give up some big yards through the air. Now it's third and six coming up. Ball on the 48-yard line. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. Loss of six on the play. They've got 10 guys up. They're coming after the kick. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Texas Tech's offense, a lot of times they can spread things out and they can really be versatile offensively, but when you've got a wide receiver like this, it really helps the coach. It does, and it, and it continues to help with what they're trying to do. They're trying to find matchups, and when you have one player like this that the defense has got to be aware of, they're going to spread you out, try to find a one-on-one -on -one matchup. If you spend too much time with this one player, they've got some other weapons to make you pay for it. Second and 13. Ball on the 17-yard line. Mike three. Mike three. Go. Go. Now he tries to buy some time. He's tackled at the 22-yard line. Bring him down right around the 34. First down. All right, T, let's go. All right, T. Take it. And he throws it away. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 34-yard line. Down at about the 47 yard line. That's how we do, D. That's how we do now. With the tackle at the 47 yard line. First down. He gets rid of this one. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 47. Complete brought down, nothing doing. Caught, and this is going to be a first down. And he's tackled at about the 37 yard line. The 37 yard line. That makes it first and 10. Scrambling around. 
Tackle made around the 28 yard line. That brings up second and nine. Check, check, Disco Raver! Check, Disco check, Raver! Check, 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 now he's flushed and they got him. Call him a loss of eight yards on the ball. Third down, and they need to get it to the 27. Mike three. Mike three. He airs it out. Makes a catch in the end zone. Touchdown. the extra point an 11 play 79 yard drive and it's good for seven points brad how about the guys up front the offensive line giving the quarterback plenty of time to be able to read the defense and make the right throw they line up to kick this one away and it goes into the end zone down for a touchback the red raiders are right where they want to be early in this one partner well this is what their coach talked about getting off to a great start the defense did their job and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board you never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Once and all, going deep. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. That could have been a huge shift in momentum if they were able to hold on to that one. Wow, that was close. Second down, 10 to go. Ball in the 25. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. He's taken down at the 27. Game of two yards. Third down. down. Five wide. Go, kill, four. kill, kill. Three, nine. He's under pressure. Nice pitch and catch for the first down. Tackle at about the 43-yard line. This passing game can be very effective if you don't get enough pressure on the quarterback. They use their personnel well and can be very tough to defend. He scrambles, decides to slide. They come out in a five wide set. Third down again. That makes it third and seven. hit immediately. Makes it out to about the 26. He's going to try and scramble. And he hits him hard at the 26. Nowhere to go on the quarterback scramble. I got you, That makes it second and 10. Here's an opening. They go to the left for a nice game. That's good for the game. Seven yards. That makes it third and three. Go ahead, two. Go. As a man, he'll lose big yards. So at the end of one, Texas Tech in front, 7-0.
And we're ready for more football here in quarter number two. On the ball, on the ball. The kick is up. It's got the distance. And he splits the uprights. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Texas Tech is up four. Quick throw, and they make the stop at about the 33-yard line. Number 17 makes the tackle at the 33-yard line. That makes it second and two. Passes to the left, and it's going the other way. And he's taken down around the 39-yard line. This quarterback better start making better decisions in the passing game. Otherwise, this corner will come up with even more picks in the future. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 39. Check four, check four. Mike seven. That's a great tackle at the 28-yard line. to about the 27-yard line. That's a game of one on the That brings us second and nine. Mike, Mike seven. Dog, kill, kill. Tries to get around the corner. A huge play, and now they're in a great position to score. him down in the backfield and that play was snuffed out from the get-go you're right it's a delayed handoff to the tailback and the defense wasn't fooled at all there from the 13 yard line second down Mike seven Mike seven dog four blue four blue four run play and he'll lose yards Corner loss loss of two yards, yards on the play. play. That, that makes, makes it third and goal. Larry, Larry. Need it out. Seven's a mic. Hey, tight, tight. Go. Quick throw in the end zone. Touchdown. A good football team has to consistently be able to capitalize when they're in the red zone. Trying to go up by three, they'll kick the extra point. He makes the PAT. So that's a six play, 40 yard drive. And the result, seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook throw. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown drive. The score now, 10 7. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Red Raiders. Coaching staff, I think, has done a nice job of doing what they wanted to do, and that's get their star wide receiver involved. But right now, they're struggling, and they're losing, and they've only got two quarters to do something about it. Well, they've done a good job of getting their receiver involved, and he's put up some numbers, but the problem is they're not finishing off these drives and putting points up on the board. And that's where I think some of these other targets are going to have to be able to come up, especially once they move the ball, they get into plus territory. Where's another receiver to make a play? Maybe the running game could take some of the pressure off. They've got to come up with some other answers at halftime here and see if they can give themselves a better chance of coming back and winning this game. He's on the run. Good tackle there in space. Complete. 
point, he's down. The defense didn't stop the pass, but they stopped him short of the sticks. And that's the important thing here. Allow him to make the catch, but make sure you tackle him before he gets to the first down marker. And watch out. They're going to bring the heat right here. Oh, excellent punt. He fields a punt at the 20, and they push him out at about the 27-yard line. And here comes the offense again. They'll try to make it two touchdowns and two possessions. So much of the passing game is about the timing between the quarterback and his wide receivers. And right now with this offense, they are in sync, and really the timing and execution is flawless. Even if you're pulling for the other team, you've got to just admire this guy's speed. He is special. Texas holds a field goal lead. Gives it to the back. He makes it to the 48-yard line. the 42-yard line. and they need to get it down to the 32. Four down, four down. Seven to Mike. Black five, black five. And he might want it all here and does. Incomplete. It's knocked down by the defense. There was definitely an opening for the quarterback to try to squeeze that pass in, but it was just a terrific play by the safety to prevent that touchdown. Right now, he wants to get this kick away and change field position. Here's the punt. No, they're going to throw it. Pulls down the catch, and he's got room here. He makes it to the 28-yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. two-yard loss. They really just didn't have any room to work on that play. The defense just suffocated them there. Texas has a three-point lead. There's a strike complete, and he's immediately tackled. It really wasn't badly played by the defense, but sometimes a good throw and catch just beats you. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 18. Going for it all. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The offense will be hoping for a little more success than they had the last time out. Mike three! Mike three! Fires out to his wideout. He's tackled around the 47-yard line. Now that's how you run a corner route. He exploded out of his cut and beat the man coverage for a new set of downs. 
First and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. He's at the 40. He makes his way out to about the 35. Texas Tech's going to have to use their second time out of the half. He is drilled at the 41. Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. It's going to be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive linemen and challenges them to start playing a little bit better. We've still got a half of football remaining. The Longhorns with a 10-point lead. We've played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. That first half did one thing for sure. It ordered up an upset. It started percolating right now. Venti size, dark brood. <laughs> Firm with a little <laughs> kick at the end, we we could have we could have one percolating here. Oh yeah, we, we didn't see it coming, but it definitely looks like this team was ready to rock, and you could see them making plays. And and it doesn't seem like it's stopping. It, it doesn't seem like they stopped the bleeding going into the second half or to the end of the first half. It looks like something that could continue. Tell you what, them boys that were favored, they better start getting ready to play because they got a fight on their hands now. David and I will be keeping an eye on your game and everything else going on in the country here in our palatial and comfortable surroundings in the studio. The best seat in the house it belongs to Brad Nessler and Kirk Herbstreit. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Longhorns continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Oklahoma! And a quick throw. They'll bring him down at about the 29-yard line. Number 16 brings him down. Slings it right down around the 27 yard line. That's a two yard loss. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. From their own 27 yard line, third down. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. And this one is a beauty. And he makes it out to about the 34-yard line. Texas Tech's coaching staff's got to be excited. Their game plan was to get it in this guy's hands, and they've done a great job of it. Well, they've done a really good job of getting the football, and they've come up with a variety of ways of putting the ball in his hands. And I think you combine the scheme with this young man's abilities, it's no wonder he's having such a big game. Tackle made around the 36-yard line. Tries to buy some time. Dives and he's down. Now he's scrambling. Slides down. He 
scrambling. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. There's a very impressive open field tackle. That's a That'll make it second and four. Gets to about the 34-yard line. That's, That's good, good for a gain, gain of one, one yard. yard. Hey, That'll That'll bring so it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Roger, Roger! Seven's the mic. Be a long day for you. Go! Go! And he's tackled after positive yardage. Catches it, and he's looking for more. Tackle at the 21-yard line. Nice run there. And he's not going to get back to the line. That'll bring up second and 11. Hey, kill, kill, kill! He's taken down at the 17-yard line. They couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage on that one. Well, I don't think they did a very good job of selling the pass. The defense was able to read the play and come right in there and make a nice stop. So we're looking at another third down here. Roger, Roger! Seven's a Mike. Mike seven. Focus, defense, green focus. eye, green eye. They get to the quarterback, and now the ball is loose. It's recovered. Recovered by the defense. And there's the lucky break that this team has been looking for. They need to get the momentum on their side and really take advantage of this mistake. Now let's see if they capitalize. The defense did a nice job shutting down the offense the last time they had the ball. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. Quick throw, incomplete, one of his receiver. I know this quarterback trusts his arm and his receivers, but he's got to know when not to throw the ball. He didn't have any room at all, and he's lucky it wasn't intercepted. He goes out of bounds around the 35-yard line. Gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Tackle made at the 29. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. He's into the open field, gets to around the 42. And he's taken down at the 42. Loss of three on the play. That makes it third and 11. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. Seven to Mike. Mike seven. Red two. And he hits him hard at the 31. That's a loss of 11 yards on the play. That makes it fourth and long.
They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Well, that was a great punt, and there was even better coverage on the return. Well, you know the offense would like to generate more than they did on their last possession. Down two possessions, this offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Throws complete, and he's hit right away. He made a good read here to find his teammate. That's sound decision-making. That brings him second and five. Reach out! He guns it right side. Great catch, and he's out of bounds. Mike three. Mike three. Scrambling around. Knocked out of bounds at the 32. So at the end of the third quarter, Texas leads 17-7. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. D-line, get that quarterback. Zero, zero, Mike Go. Seven alert, nine. alert, steamer, steamer, alert. <laughs> Makes the grab and he's got the first. Yes, sir. First down. Here, Stop at the six yard line. That's a game of 13 on the way. That makes it first and goal. Go. Disco Raver! Disco Raver! Quick strike to the back, no good. They're at the six. It's second down. He scrambled. And a nice move to finish it off. Touchdown. No one could break clear, so the QB decided to run it in. You've got to like it when your leader takes things into his own hands, especially down inside the 10. Here's the point after to try to cut this to a three-point game. And he adds the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And they can forget about returning this one. A score here might effectively end this one. Texas is up a field goal. They'll get him for a loss. Loss of four on the play. That makes it second and 14. It's second down now and 14 to go. Ball on their own 21. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. Here we go, here we go. Gets it off as he's hit. Complete. And they push him out at the 25. Dumps it complete over the middle. And down he goes at about the 37-yard line. Good gain on the pass to the running back. This young man is becoming more and more part of this passing game. He does a great job of making guys miss after the catch. And he's level at the 39. A yard, maybe two on the carry. If it's any consolation, he did pick up some positive yards. But I doubt that's enough to make him forget the hit that he just took. Catches it, and that's all. They'll rest 
wrestling down in the backfield. And that run got stuffed. Yeah, you're right. The defense definitely won the battle at the line of scrimmage there. This is a great punt blocking team, and it looks like they're going to try to get to this one. It's away, and it's a booming punt. He takes it at the 14. Tackle at the 19. The Red Raiders battled all game long, but it's not looking so good right now. Well, but remember, they're still within striking distance here. If they can put together a drive, they got a shot to win this game. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. Just under three to go in regulation. It's the sophomore that's got it. He's tackled at the 30-yard line. Number 31 brings him down at the 30-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Turn down. Great pressure on the quarterback forced that incompletion. Boy, they really pounded him on that throw. Third and five situation. Ball on the 35. Takes it and he's tackled short. You can't teach instinct. The ability to know where a play is going is something this safety has. That was a terrific effort. Hey, defense, let's go. Pick it up, D. Mike three. Mike three. He's hit and taken down. Number 16 on the tackle at the 46 yard line. First down. Zero, zero, Mike free. Oh, and a huge drop by the wide out here in the fourth quarter. From their own 46 yard line. Second down. He's on the run. They'll bring him down around the 40 yard line. That's a team of 14 yards on the play. First down. Just under two to go in the game. Tries to get out of trouble, but he can't shake the defense. That's a six of seven yards. That'll make it seven and nine. It's the ninth play of the drive. Roger, Roger. Zero, zero, Mike three. Come to the right night. Quick throw. He's out of bounds at the 50-yard line. they come up with here on third and very long the offensive coordinator and the quarterback know let's see if they can convert just a tremendous job by that defense and their coordinator did a super job there to keep it this close in this ball game and now the offense has got a chance to win it Zips it right. 
Well, you can talk about offense all you want, and they were good today, but the defense was better. They come up with a play of the day, and that'll lead to the victory. late in the fourth quarter in a very important and a very tight football game. And who's going to come to the forefront? We'll see who's got the most leadership. And some daylight. Out of bounds at about the 33-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Under a minute left. Texas Tech will take their first time out of the half. And he gets a yard on the run. Yeah, it was a short gain, but a nice tackle there by the senior corner who came in from the outside and made a nice play. Four, four, two, four. Nice run up the middle. Good pickup. And with a new set of downs, a chance to kill even more time. The Red Raiders are going to call their second time out. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. He'll go down to one knee. Texas Tech's called their final timeout from the 30-yard line. Second down. He takes a knee. summarize the action of this one. Texas comes away with bragging rights this year, and I'm sure the fans and students will enjoy it just as much as the players. They were the better team today and added another great chapter to this rivalry. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.